Oh, no, 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 no. This is what happens when you don't come prepared for your trip. So, according to my poorly made plan, I was supposed to leave Seoul to go to Busan with the bus. So, after checking out of the hotel, I went to the bus station in Seoul and got my ticket. The price was quite expensive, around 35 euros. But maybe it was because I didn't bought the ticket in advance. The bus looked like a regular bus. Here I tried to validate my ticket and when I get on I notice that my seat is occupied. Oh, that one. Wrong bus. Oh, no, 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 no. I accidentally got on the wrong bus. Luckily, my bus was the other one on the other side of the stall. To my surprise, the inside of this bus was very different from the other. You guys can see the seats are very premium. They have this little display similar to the one you have on the airplane and then the seat is fully reclined and you can see these buttons you can set the reclining seat. The display can be connected to your cell phone. Here you can see I was watching my vlog on this little display. Then I reclined my seat and I spent all the time on the bus sleeping. I arrived to Busan bus station after roughly 3 hours and 30. And from the bus station I took the subway and went to my hostel. thing about Nara map is that it tells you which exit you have to go. So you guys can see exit number 8. Get off and the map. So it, it works pretty well. I didn't have any issue when I was here. Like I always have done during my trip in South Korea, I stopped by a convenience store and bought water and this corn dog. It was alright, I'm not a huge fan of corn dogs. Anyways, that's everything for this vlog. I will show what I did in Busan in the next vlog.